Hello and welcome to Beam NG Drive. I'm David in Ark, and today we're going to try a little experiment. I have no idea if this is going to work, but what I'm going to try to do is we are going to fire up the replay tool. Come on, customize UI apps. What is going on? We want to add in the replay tool. Normally, Alt R. Uh, we'll fire up the replay tool, but obviously that's not working because um, I have the G-Force overlay thing, which is stupid. But anyhow, we're going to record. All right, so we're going to use the replay tool to record. I've got the ME262 or 282 or whatever number it is. Anyway, I've got this in the game, and I've got four... AI vehicles, so AI, and we will just let them drive around uh, randomly. So now the AI vehicles should be driving around, and now we will take off in our... <laughs> the missile already has a lock. Listen, I'm not even in the air yet. All right, let's, let's get off the ground, and then I'm going to attempt to take out the AI recording it with replay to see if the game can keep tabs on what's happening with the AI vehicles. Now we're going to have to come back around here. Come on. Let's get back around. We'll see if the missile can get a lock. All right, the missile is locking on somebody. Whew, we fire a missile and I don't know if we hit an AI vehicle or not, but it was worth a shot. This missile still has another lock. Whoa, into the trees. We'll see what happens when this comes around. The missile is locking. Oh, it has a lock. Let's see. Oh, off into the distance and boom, baby. We have no idea if we've hit any targets or not. I've got one more missile to go. It's locking. It has a lock. Um, I have no idea where that missile decided to go. You're not even close to anything. What is that? All right, so anyhow, there you go. That is playing around in the replay. So we have no idea if the missiles actually hit anything or what the consequences are. And I'm curious to see if when we replay our recording here, if we can switch vehicles and see if we actually hit anything. Oh, well, well, there we, hey, you know what? We hit the runway. That's the important thing. Sure, we crash landed, but, you know, we at least hit the runway. All right, so I want to come over here. I'm going to stop the recording, the replay recording. Now, the way this works is that once you stop the recording, then uh, it will automatically start the playback for you. So... We will let this do this. The airplane should be taking off. How long did I sit here? I guess I sat here for quite a while. I didn't remember sitting here that long, did I? Yes, I did. Wow, okay. <laughs> I did not realize I sat here as long as I did. Now, for the sake of argument, I'm just going to tab through the other vehicles just so you can see that we do, in fact, have... Oh, well... This dude's already in the tree. Not good for him. Okay, here we go. The airplane takes off. Look at that. Got the landing gear back in. And now I'm going to try to do something here. Let's see what happens because I don't know who's who. So when we fire a missile, I'm going to pause the physics. Oh, there it is right there. And let's go chase this missile down and see what on earth we ended up hitting. Look at that. Ooh, that is a massive explosion. The question is though, did we actually hit a vehicle? To be honest, I don't think there's a vehicle here. I think it was detecting a vehicle possibly nearby or through the other side of this. I mean, there's not even a road here. I don't know what you were picking up on. So let's just, for the sake of argument, tab around. It's definitely not you. It's certainly not you. 
not even you, although you have managed to put yourself into a tree and you are still in a tree. I don't see. Okay, so where, where is that explosion? It's back over here. All right, so let's just take a look here. I'm trying to get a feel for where it thinks it was shooting. No, that's not even on that side of the uh, map. Let's take a look here. Um, no, not you either. This is so weird. Okay. How about you? Does it think it was going for you? Not that I can tell. Okay. So it's really hard to tell which vehicle it thought it was going after, but there we go. It, it tried anyway. So we're going to have another shot at it. I want to see if we hit anybody. Oh, that one. Look at that. Takes a nosedive right here into the woods. Again, though, there's nobody actually right here. So I'm not sure what the targeting system is using to try to decide who it's going to hit. Because that one is also not near anyone, I don't believe. Just walking through. Nope. Okay. All right. That's fine. We'll just... Take another shot at it and see what happens here. So it's actually pretty hard on this particular map. Oops, sorry, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> it's, it's hard on this particular map to actually hit an AI. On other maps, it's actually pretty simple. Um, there, it, It's a little more open, and uh, you get the attacks in. Oh, please tell me you hit something over here. Nothing. Oh, man. So one of the other things you can do with the replay tool, of course, is we can actually back things up just a little. So if we back it up, whoop, okay, wait a minute. Oh, because I'm paused, shoot. Wait, stop, what are you doing? Oh, I guess it's, I don't know what it's doing. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. That's kind of weird, but and then of course, we get this other lock on and this one just goes, oh wait, that was that same one there, okay. And we circle back around here. It's getting a lock on something. And we fire that missile. Oh, no, I see. I backed it up even further than I thought. Okay. So that one goes there. But there's, again, nobody there. So obviously not a good map. At least I'm going to blame it on the map anyway. And that one goes sailing off into the distance for whatever reason okay so i'll tell you what let's find another map we'll do another replay we'll attack some vehicles and let's see if we can actually take out some of the ai cars then we will hit record so now we're recording a new replay come on get you going dude get you going get you going all right let's see if we can get this bad boy off the ground I do not like this at all. I am not too keen on this here. I don't think we're actually going to make it. Ooh, oh, that was a little scary. Okay. All right. So we've got vehicles out and about somewhere. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is going on? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why is my plane? What the heck was that? Okay, well, that didn't work so well. <laughs> let's, let's try that again. What? I have no idea why. That was weird. I, I, I have no idea why I could not get the airplane up in the air. I'm sure you guys will tell me down in the comments, but that was so bizarre. All right, let's get... This is not... Oh, my gosh. It is not getting up in the air whoa 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 oh i hit the wrong key okay okay i i was hitting the key uh that decelerates um thinking it was going to pick me up uh, off the ground so that's that's where that comes in okay so we should be locking in somewhere over here it's got a lock yep that's going to be that dude over there somewhere maybe then again i don't know that just doesn't feel right i don't think that car would be over there yet, but I, I could be wrong. Now the missile has a lock. I get that. Let's drive. Let's cruise around here. Now we should be getting a lock. 
Now, the problem is if the vehicle went under the tunnel, and see, that's what I think. I think right there, that vehicle is under the tunnel, and that is who it went out for. Now, that one, I don't know why it keeps picking somebody way off in the middle of nowhere. There's a lock. Is that going to get us anything? Well, no, it did hit the ground surface, but I don't think we took out any vehicles here today we are out of missiles and so we will do a crash landing onto the highway or something let's just see if we can coast i mean we're going 350 miles an hour how bad could this be we should theoretically be able to circle around until well actually you know what i know you guys don't care about this we don't care there's the landing gear and we are coming down. I know, I know. Ooh, I just, I would like to land, you know, normally, but it's not going to happen. We're going way too fast. So, you know what? I say we just aim for the tunnel and call it good. Goosh! <laughs> ah. I love this game. Okay, so let's stop the recording. And now it's going to... Now remember, uh, it's still going to be recording even though I crash at first. So that's that is a, that's a key component. That's a key thing to be aware of. Right? So it records everything you do until you tell it to stop. So uh, this, this first little bit is me taking off and then... Okay, so I'm at 100%. No, I, I'm not reducing the thrust. I thought I was reducing the thrust. I'm not. It's just not. That is so weird. It just would not stay aloft. I don't know what I did, but that did not work. Okay, so we try this again, and now here is where we will take this bad boy and fire missiles at the AI drivers, and we will do the same thing we did last time. We will, come on. I love doing the replay. By the way, if you're if you're doing this, uh, you do a replay, and if you hit Alt U, that will hide the interface. And of course, you can change cameras. Right. Oh yeah, look at that. All right. Sorry, <laughs> I'm playing around. All right, so here we go. And somewhere in here, there we go. So we fire the first missile. Let's see where the missile goes. Is it actually going to be anywhere near? Look at that. Oh, I love this. Look at that. Yeah, a missile frozen in time in midair. Anybody see free guy? There you go. That's the equivalent of free guy. All right, here we go. Except what we get is whoosh straight into the side of this mountain, which makes me wonder if there's an AI vehicle on the other side, or was on the other side of this. Oh, well, he's right there. So I'll bet it was trying to shoot him through here. Now, the problem I have here is that I think I've already fired off my second missile I did. So that's okay. Fire that one off. And then we will come around one more time. Let's see. That one goes off down there. Let's see where this one's going. Oh, man. All right. So we can see this one is also going to end up crashing uh, or firing into this ground right here. But if we keep going straight through where it thinks it's going to go... There should be an AI vehicle. There it is right there. That's the one it's shooting for. But the missile doesn't know that there's ground in the way. And so, therefore, that missile is launched and the vehicle simply just drives away. Oh, man, that is cool. Look at that. I love watching this kind of stuff. There we go. We are flying and now we're heading straight to the tunnel. Oh yeah, I forgot I made it make a circle. This is one of the things I love about replay mode, 
right? I mean, I can even set my camera right here and we just watch the airplane fly around as it circles, takes a dive coming down. You can see it swooping in and here is where things are about to go horribly, terribly wrong. Look at that right there. Landing gear is down and squoo. <laughs> that is great. Oh, I love this game. That is so, so cool. Okay, so, and then when it gets to the end, that is the end of the replay. So I think, hmm. All right, I have, I have, I have another idea. Because this isn't really working because of all of the terrain, I think what we can try is what if we just simply go to the small pure grid uh, and actually, oh, well, let's see, I, I got to spawn in, uh, hang on. All right, I got to spawn in the airplane. Boom. Okay. And then we're going to have the AI, and I'll tell you what, this time we're going to have the AI flee from us because I really want the AI to take off. <laughs> now, the missile, of course, has a lock because the truck is dead in front of us, but that's not really what we're after. Right? We're going to we're going to go up, we're going to fly around a little bit. Come on. Get me off the ground. Uh, let's see. Let's get some flaps. There we go. All right. Now we got no flaps. Okay. There we go. So we are flying. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I forgot. I know. The missile has a lock, but we want to see if we bank around. Now, the next time the missile gets a lock, I will go ahead and fire. I'm curious to see if we'll even see the. Whoa. Didn't realize we were that far down. Okay, missile is locking. Missile has a lock. We are firing. I have no idea if we hit the truck or not. The missile has a lock again. We're going to take on this truck. We're going to take him out one way. Oh, that does not look good. I believe we, we absolutely destroyed the truck. Oh, man. It is not looking good. For the truck, we've got, what, one more missile to go. I have no idea if that one actually is, well, supposedly it hit the truck. I'm going to fly over. Let's just see. Okay, there's no way this truck is doing 400 miles an hour, so where? Huh. Well, I have no idea. Oh, wait. Oh, there's pieces and parts of it. All right, so. At this point, we're just going to stop in midair because we don't really care. This is the replay, remember? So, I'm... Oops, I don't, sorry, I'm not... There, I don't care about that. All right, I'm actually going to do this from the truck's point of view. All right, so the truck is trying to flee. Here comes the airplane behind it. Oh, this is so cool, man. Oh, I love stuff like this. I love like replay mode in BeamNG. Oh, look at that. Oh, he's coming for you. You think you're going to get away, but you are not. By the way, when you're in replay, uh, you can actually do things like, oh, no, you can't. I thought I could turn the lights on in the truck, but no, no, I can't. All right, there goes the airplane. It is circling back around and somewhere in here. Oh, there it is. Here comes the missile. Oh, holy cow. Look at that. Absolutely obliterated. Wait a minute. Now, I think, can I not? Yeah, I can actually jump back in time. All right. And then we're going to actually slow things down because, oh my gosh, this is so wicked. So we slow things down. Here it comes. Whew, the replay is not happy with me. 
I guess I jumped back a little further than I thought. All right. Let's speed this up just a hair. Here comes the missile. Oh, there it is. Oh, just right up the tailpipe, man. You, can't, you just, you can't argue with that. Oh, oh, and here comes another missile. Oh, man, that is insane. And yeah, you know, I didn't think that this, that the truck could be going that fast, but after being hit by three missiles, yeah, it, the, the missiles are just absolutely pushing this thing all the way. Look at, here comes another missile. Oh, that is fantastic. Absolutely love that. So, so cool. Once again, I'd like to, let's see, I, I should have paid attention to where uh, the first hit comes in. It is somewhere, oops, somewhere yep, right in there. Okay, so 59, so around 58. So let's slow this back down again. Let's do 32 times slower. We're going to watch this. Now, again, the replay is having some issues. Oh, look at that. Here it comes. Look at the missile coming in. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh, and you can see the missile disappears just as it hits the truck and blam, absolutely blows the truck to bits. That is fantastic. Oh, that is so cool. I don't really know if we are on real time. Now there's real time. Oh, here comes another missile. Shroom, look at that. Blowing the hood completely off of the vehicle. Or I think that was the hood. <laughs> it's kind of hard to tell now. Oh, there it is again. Oh, so much fun. So the answer to the question is yes. Yes, replay does work very well with airplane with the airplane attacking oh that is so cool so so cool with the uh, airplane attacking AI vehicles running away so you definitely have got to give that a try if you've not played with the replay tool I actually have a tutorial on how the replay tool works and uh, if I figure this out right I'll have a link to that maybe it'll be a little card thing that pops up in the upper corner or something but anyhow uh, you can mess around with that but I wholeheartedly recommend playing around with the replay tool now remember the replay tool is not a video recorder it's not recording your gameplay into a video format it is recording all of the pieces and parts playing along, but it's just a way for you to be able to uh, change angles, switch vehicles, um, basically review your own gameplay from various angles. In order to record this, you still have to have some kind of a screen recorder, OBS, GeForce Experience, you name it. In any case, that is fantastic. Oh, Absolutely love it. Got any questions, problems, suggestions, horror stories? Feel free to leave those down in the comments section below. Special thanks to Hero of God, Gamer Gall, and Los Wilco for supporting me on Patreon. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time in Beam NG Drive. I'm David and Ark. <laughs> Unlike the driver of this truck, I hope you have a great day. Oh, thanks for watching. Oh, that is so just wicked. Absolutely wicked.